Hey everybody, so I am getting my hair cut today. After not having a haircut in like nine years, I've just gotten a few trims, but since I was like 18 years old in high school, I have not gotten a haircut. And back then I got it cut to like this length. And now it is very, 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 very long and a huge pain in my butt. So today I am meeting the stylist that I know, hairstylist, makeup artist, sorry, I'm a mess. Um, and she's going to be doing some fancy updos on me and we're gonna be doing a little photo shoot for her portfolio and then we are going to be cutting it. And I'm really nervous because it's gonna be a massive drastic change but it's, it's time for a change. You know, a lot of things in my life are changing right now and I want to mix it up and change my hair. And don't mind my face right now. I have no makeup on except for some powder foundation and a little concealer because like I said, she's a hairstylist and makeup artist so she's gonna be doing my makeup for this photo shoot. But I feel so awkward just putting on my foundation and then just leaving it at that like no mascara no highlight nothing it's just oh but yeah so i asked her if i'd be able to make a vlog during it and she said that would be fine so it's not probably gonna be during the cut or style itself but you'll see the before and afters oh i'm so nervous They're breeding, you'll never get them all out. Really? Okay, so it is 24 hours post haircut and I am in love. My hair is so bouncy and so light and I put it up into like a little ponytail and it brushes my neck. I am so in love. I, I feel great. I feel gorgeous. I feel new. I am so happy. With my new hair, I've, I've basically just been playing with it non-stop since I got home at like 3.30 in the afternoon yesterday. I was at the salon for like four and a half hours and it was entirely worth it. But as you guys saw, I was there for so long because with my hair still really long, we did that big dramatic updo and then I did a photo shoot modeling it. I know, book me now. And then we had to brush all of that out and then cut it. And then we did another photo shoot with a fan and just something fun with the short hair, which was curled and adorable. So I have one more thing to show you guys because you are not gonna believe this. This is what I got cut off. It's like as long as the hair that's left. And this is braided, this is braided. This is how much we took off. And before you ask, yes, I'm going to donate it. The salon didn't sell it for me because I was like, I need this. 
I need this. This is just going to be so hilarious to see in pictures and videos and stuff. But I'm going to unbraid it. I'm going to measure it. Make sure it's long enough. I'm sure it will be because, I mean, really, if this isn't at least 12 inches, my measuring tape is wrong. And then I'm going to rebraid it up nice and tight, package it up, and donate it to Wigs for Kids, which is an awesome, awesome charity. Way better than a lot of the other places that people donate their hair to. So, Wigs for Kids this is what you're getting because this is totally undyed, it's never been dyed, never been bleached, nothing like that. So, well, I have included a couple little teaser images with the hairstyles that we did, but because I did that photo shoot, I'm not sharing too many. As I get finished shots from the photographer at the salon, I'm going to be sharing them on Tumblr and Instagram. So if you guys want to see that, I have links to all my social media just down in the description box. So you can check there, follow me, or just pop in every now and again to see the final photos because I'm really excited. I saw a whole bunch of them just as we finished shooting. The photographer scrolled through some and they look amazing and I hate photos of myself and I think they look amazing. So I'm very excited. I'm going to have the links to the salon and the stylist that did my hair and my makeup and all of that in the description box as well. If you're in the Milwaukee area, please go check her out. Her name is Cheryl Holteren. She's at Beauty Milwaukee and she is incredible. She's super nice. She's super talented. I've, she's done a whole bunch of like hair work for um, weddings and things like that. She loves avant-garde stuff as you can see and it she's just great. So if you need a haircut or you need your hair styled for some event and she's starting to get into makeup artistry too, so if you need a makeup artist, please check her out because that was such a fantastic experience with her and that salon is gorgeous just breathtakingly gorgeous. So thank you guys for joining me on my fantastic hair adventure. Leave a like if you enjoyed watching me get, you know, a foot or more of my hair cut off. We'll see what this ends up being. And um, subscribe if you're not already. You can just hit this button right up here to subscribe. And thank you guys for checking it out. I hope you enjoy your day.